I, uh, I knew he'd been drinking. I watched him pound drink after drink. I knew he was leaving, but I didn't see him grab his keys. I guess I wasn't paying attention. Yeah. I wish I would have known that would have been the last time I'd see him. I don't know why I didn't see this coming. She was beautiful inside and out. There were a lot of people there that night. I knew she only had one drink, but I didn't realize that she had walked away from her glass. I saw them leave together, and she looked pretty wasted for only having one drink. But I ignored it. She only made it to the parking lot, because that's where he raped her and left her to die. She had been sad a lot recently. I see that now. It wasn't always like that, though. Everyone loved her. She used to be so full of joy and kindness. But then one day, everything changed. Anger can attack at any moment. Any moment. We get angry about a variety of things, such as delays, not being able to talk to family, or when the flight is not working together. Anger can be instigated by a stubbed toe, or when an MTI yells at you. Some of you may be angry about your past or relationships that didn't go right. The list goes on and on. Anger pushes people away even though we might desire them to be close. Yet there is one constant. Anger usually results in pain for you and for others. Generally, anger delays your success in BMT and in life. Anger causes you to lose focus on your mission. Here are some myths about anger. Number one, there are some people who just can't control their anger. Myth number two, anger is not from God. Myth number three, our parents don't teach us anything about anger. Myth number four, there are no good forms of anger. And finally, myth number five, anger is a strong feeling of displeasure. Actually, anger comes from the concept of red nose. It's a Hebrew term. That means our core temperature rises and our body displays visible signs. Yes, the body reacts. We call it anger readiness. The origins can be both biological and learned. Now, I must add that there are good forms of anger. For instance, you might get very angry that the flight didn't follow the procedures as given by your MTI. So you channel that anger into a positive outcome. Some call it anger that motivates us or righteous indignation. Another example is when you are angry for a cause or at an injustice. Remember, we all learn how to express our anger from our parents or those adults who raised us. By the way, anger is a God-given emotion, so it is not all bad. It is bad when not controlled and used properly. Most people don't know this, but anger is actually a secondary emotion. In other words, some other emotion precedes the anger feelings. Some causes include fear, hurt, and frustration. An example of anger that comes from fear is when we feel threatened from another.